With our current weather conditions, it takes a real expert to create landscape that'll thrive. Riedel's Garden Center has the staff with the expertise who know all about the requirements for plants, lawns, and landscapes that'll stand up to our changing weather conditions. With 25 years of hands-on experience, owner Darren Riedel will customize a landscape design and irrigation system to meet your expectations and our climate. It is recommended to protect your lawn using Fertilone products available at Riedel's Garden Center, an authorized dealer. Call or stop by Riedel's Garden Center today. Hi, I'm Dr. Laura Wilson and thanks for joining us for another week of Green and Growing. Today we're going to talk a little bit about how to, for lack of a better term, coexist with nature in our garden. We talk about pollinator gardens and how important it is to support our bees and butterflies, but one of the things that comes with supporting butterflies is also supporting caterpillars. So if you see caterpillars on your plants, if you have a tendency to destroy those caterpillars, then you're not going to get butterflies later in the summer. So here we are in midsummer, and one of the uh, big caterpillars that we see hatching right now are checker spot caterpillars. So if you have any members of the family Astraceae in your, in your garden, which you probably do because these are our native Echinacea stoneflowers, our Rubecchias like our black-eyed Susans, uh, sunflowers, asters, daisies, those are all in the same flower family. And these are a host plant for checker spot caterpillars. The same way that the milkweed is the host plant for the monarchs and dill is a host um, plant for um, our, our, some of our swallowtails. So if you like checker spots in your gardens as butterflies, you have to be able to support their um, larvae, so their caterpillars as well. It's a little bit um, uncool of these, of these uh, butterflies because they will lay a hundred eggs on the same leaf and then they'll all hatch at the same time and really just kind of take down the foliage on a lot of these plants, which you can see, see happening here to my black eyed Susans right now. And it does leave a bit of a blight. Um, so there are different ways that we can remedy this, but without uh, destroying the caterpillars since we do want the butterflies in our garden. Um, and, and so some of the ways is either you just leave them, especially if they're plants that are, aren't necessarily in a prominent position, just let them have the plant, especially if they're not spreading from plant to plant. If they are in maybe a showpiece of your garden, you can take clippings from the leaves and actually move them to a different plant um, within this same sunflower family and let them call and let them eat um, the leaves on those plants. Uh, some people also take them and set them up in a habitat like we do for our swallowtails and monarchs as well, and let them uh, grow and pupate within a, a container of sorts. So there are ways of, of helping support pollinators and having a beautiful garden without pulling out the insecticides. So even if you do use an insecticide to get rid of the caterpillars, remember that's going to get rid of every pollinator that visits that plant, including adult bees and adult butterflies. So it's really important to think about finding a balance in the garden between maybe sacrificing the foliage of some of the plants to support the pollinators that we absolutely need for our fruits and our vegetables and our flowers um, and that help make a healthy ecosystem. Feel free to check out the Ellis County Master Gardeners Facebook page and website for more information about how to support pollinators as well as how to maintain a balance between the insects that we need and the flowers that we love. Thanks for joining us this week. I hope you have a great one. With our current weather conditions, it takes a real expert to create landscape that'll thrive. Riedel's Garden Center has the staff with the expertise who know all about the requirements for plants, lawns, and landscapes that'll stand up to our changing weather conditions. With 25 years of hands-on experience, owner Darren Riedel will customize a landscape design and irrigation system to meet your expectations and our climate. It is recommended to protect your lawn using Fertilone products available at Riedel's Garden Center, an authorized dealer. Call or stop by Riedel's Garden Center today.